You are now listening to 15 Minutes of Fame Radio. Let's go! You can't argue with it. So, so I, mean, I have to ask out. you, right? Yeah. Because uh, there's always been the you and Lux talk, you and Surf talk, and you and Verb talk. So looking at Lu uh, Surf after he battled Lux, and then right after that he battles 40 and he loses the 40. Both. Both. Both right, guys. right, okay. Um, how do you like feel like do you not want to battle surf now <laughs> i mean the battle the battle like this is the thing see a lot of people like surf had some fire last night that right? he did i told you him I mean? his shit last night was better than the shit he had for yeah. months so uh, surf problem is his preparation you don't know how to prepare well i'm a nigga you cannot play like that with the thing with me is you cannot come around me like that so i, I really think surf should take a couple different battles and and have a consistent Back to back 3 0, and not even a 3 0, three rounds. Just have, you don't even have to win them. Just consistently have a back to back three round performance, and then I'm down. Because like, I want the fight, you know what I mean? I don't want the battle, I want the fight. You know, same thing with Lux. Like, it was never a Lux campaign or JC chasing Lux. Like, who y'all thought was the best? All right, let's do it. When I said, when y'all said this nigga was the best, or this nigga was the best, or this nigga was the best, and I went after all of them, ain't nobody say nothing. Then I went after a nigga niggas felt like was unreachable. Niggas wanna put this criteria out that I gotta that I gotta go. Nah. I'm one of the most consistent niggas ever. If niggas want a shot at me, prove yourself. Period. That's it. Yeah, that's the type of bullshit we on now. Prove Y'all niggas want a shot, man. Y'all niggas gotta show. Because what I'm not gonna do is say, all surf gotta do in my opinion is is prep his three rounds the right way because we know the material the gonna be out rap, of line. Yeah. The niggas really good. The nigga like can we rap. not gonna never but boy, he would. I know how smart of a battle of surface. He would never come with two rounds for JC. He would never come with two rounds for John John. He could fuck around and come with two for Cortez, but he ain't doing that with no JC and no John John. Bro. So how, isn't that. that disrespect to forty to say, oh, Surf would never come with two rounds? Like this is still forty bars. Right, this is not, top no, 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 no. Okay, no, first I'll give of all, you this I just want to say this. Right? Everybody already know forty. Like all time since from day one when I was fucking with the female battle rap. 40 is always my third favorite ever after official and jazz. So I'm not going to never discredit 40. She's, I feel like writing wise, nobody in battle rap writes like her on the Queen of the Rings side. Like, mm. Her pen is really out of line. Like, it's a few that could really it's write. It's really like that. Too. She's really like that. Yeah. Like, but what I'm saying is, I don't think Surf had two rounds for 40. I think he really. I don't know. He was I'm gonna give it to you like this. That's a fact. I'm gonna give it to you like, to you like this. He might have. Is it disrespectful to 40? Absolutely. Let, uh, Did he try to disrespect Forty by coming half ass prepared? Absolutely. All right. So and she kicked his motherfucking ass. So let me ask you something. That's what happens. You disrespect any. You you slack. You half ass and same shit happened with Lux. He did all this talking. That's Lux. But I'm surf. But I'm surf. And he got in that ring. Half assing. And the bad and thing is he had all three for Lux. Ass. Remember he had three rounds for Lux. He just choked every round. He had to bring it back. He said the mic fucked on. But whatever. What I'm saying is. I, I don't want to say it's disrespect to 40 because the girl's always going to look at it like it's disrespect. Especially you got to think about a nigga like Surf, his ego and his character, how he move. Like, he don't care about these females, so... You I'm think not, Michael Jordan going to get super drunk the night before he's got to fucking play Lisa Leslie the next day? I don't think Michael, Michael ever let Jordan's, Lisa Leslie beat him. Michael Jordan is just I'm, not no, playing. He's it, a different man. He's I'm not, not he's taking his craft very seriously. The point silly. I'm trying to make is that... You know, Lisa, Le like 40 is Lisa Leslie in battle rap. Yeah, no, that's right. Correct. And I agree. So if Jordan is playing Lisa Leslie, do you think he's going to take her light? Can I, can I make it? Uh, well, the answer is no. That question? The answer is no. Okay. I wanna no. Add, so sh he shouldn't, t like, nobody should take 40 bars light. No, no, no. You're 110% right. But I want to throw something out there and I want to know how y'all feel about it. Like, do you feel like Surf thought prepping for the battle like he he's going in there to win against 40 that's what he want to do of course do you feel like he he feeling like oh i could write two for 40 knowing that 40 right recently right. been having choking right. problems think about it it could be possible like all right maybe if i mess up it's a possibility 40 gonna choke yep. so it's like i don't know i'm not saying that's what he's thinking i'm just saying that could possibly be what's going and on let's be real let's, no, let's be boy. real it's the narrative what's up yeah boy? Right? It's Girl, the you narrative. Can't be shaking the ops, hand, we're, listen, bro. JC, man. And we're gonna keep it real. Oh. We gonna keep it real. <laughs> it, uh, shout out to Prep too, man. Listen, we're gonna keep it real. It's the narrative, right? She 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 messes up in a lot of battles. She's known to. Whatever. Whatever. You get on camera a lot and brag about your status. 
I'm surf. I'm surf. I'm surf. Why you don't think somebody gonna take you serious? And it's the thing. If you don't think you're gonna lose, I'm. Mean, hey, listen. All I know is you, I'm gonna be you disrespected honest. her by coming in there half ass, and she beat the shit out of her. I kind of feel shit. like that about all of his elite opponents, like, cause Forty is an elite. Whether she's a female or not, she's an elite battler. Stature wise, everything she put in his work, she did all that. 100%. So what I'm saying is, Surf get held to such a high pedestal, and he don't. I don't. I don't know why he felt. And then it's not only his fault because. If I pay you such and such amount, I don't know what nobody getting paid, but if I give somebody a certain amount of bread and you come and you choke, cool. Cause remember when Lux first choked against Calico, there's a lot of controversy behind that with everything. So everybody got to be held to the same standard, especially elite name battlers. When you getting paid a certain amount, you're not, Surf is not considered just a regular battle rapper. Surf is really considered with the elites out here. So people want to see you come with three, Surf. You know, you know what's going on. Like me and him talk outside of battle rap. Like we speak, we be in contact. So he know like the fans gonna, he got a, such a strong fan base that they gonna fight for him regardless of anything. And I think that kind of hurt his stock. Not his stock, but it's hurting him as an artist. Like, because he, that's, that's putting him to where he feel like, Regardless to what happened, my fans gonna jack me. At the end of the day, right or wrong, like if they gonna keep jacking me, what, what somebody gonna tell me? Look at Clips. Clips came out one of the craziest runs ever in battle rap when he first started. But when his head blew up because of his fan base, he had one of the craziest fan bases ever. He started yeah, freestyling rounds. Man. He remember Clips was the first one ever known for coming with two rounds. If we keep it in the book, and they was letting first, him live. They was Clips was the live. very first battle when niggas was saying that man not coming with third rounds. Man was coming with two yeah, rounds. He was the first of one. Bars about it too. But Clips versus Verb when he got that first shot on something, man, you think he played with Verb? He knew what was at stake. I'ma kill him. But this is what I'm saying. We know what you can do. We know what y'all capable of. We done seen it. Y'all wouldn't be with y'all if y'all ain't do it in the past. But now it's like you gotta keep that consistent. Yeah, that's all the, way the thing. Through. You can't live off of that. Like every time, every time niggas get in interviews, they talk about, like, sir, say, I'm, I'm, I'm picking doors. I'm knocking babies out the playpen. That's a ten year old bar. That that baby grown now. He ready to fight back. Like uh -huh. that's an old bar. We can't keep living off these old moments. Like you need something. Burnt. You need something recently. Like we talk about NBA references all the time. NFL references. It's a what have you done for me lately sport. And they, you know damn well you only as good as your last performance. If niggas is not respecting what you laid down last time, you cannot talk them up for your next one. They just not, they're not gonna fuck with it like that. 15 minutes of fame. You are now listening to 15 minutes of fame, baby. Let's go!